Hi friends, and welcome to drama class. Today we're going to start out with our circle time questions of the day. Now you already know some of the questions that we're doing. We say our name and then our favorite color and then our favorite animal and then we do what noise that animal makes, right? And then because this week is around the world week, we're going to keep learning our addresses. And today we're going to find out what country we live in. Does that sound like fun? All right, so I'll go first with all those questions. My name is Miss Sherlock. My favorite color is blue. My favorite animal is a monkey. And I live in the country, the United States of America. And that's where you live too. Are you ready to try it all by yourself? Okay, what's your name? What's your favorite color? What's your favorite animal? What noise does that animal make? Good. Now, what country do you live in? The United States of America. Great job, guys. You guys are learning so well. I'm so excited to keep practicing that with you. But we're going to move on to our next part of the lesson today. And today, I figured because we're going around the world, we're going to go to Africa a country, and we are going to go on a safari with our purple book, because I know you guys have so much fun with those. So like I said, we're going to be going on a safari today, and you guys are going to be different animals, and you're going to have so much fun. Are you ready? Okay, so can I have you stand center stage? Where center stage? Mm -hmm. Very good guys, stand nice and tall and get ready. All right, you are going to be all of the kids and all of the animals. How are you gonna do that? I guess we'll see, here we go. Once upon a time, some kids were playing outside pretending to be jungle animals. Can you pretend to be jungle animals? All of a sudden, they had an idea and they said, let's go to a real jungle. Can you say that? Let's go to a real jungle. Great job, guys. Everyone thought this was a great idea. So they packed their bags. Can you pack your bag? Ooh, make sure you put your binoculars in there. And they got ready to go. Once they were finished packing, they got onto an airplane because Africa was so far away. Can you go onto an airplane? All right, let's fly. Whoa! And they made it to Africa. When the plane landed, the, the kids got their bags and went off. And it was time for their African safari to begin. So they got into their car that would take them to see all of the animals. Go ahead into your car. Put on your seatbelt. Very good. And then they drove and drove to go see the animals. Pretty soon, they saw some elephants. Can you say, I see elephants? Very good. And the children tiptoed over to the elephants where and watched them. The elephants were taking a bath in the river. Okay, now change into elephants. Can you walk around like an elephant? Very good, make elephant noises. Great job, and now take a bath in the river. Can you take a bath? Oh, go ahead, wash, 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 wash. Good. After 
after the children saw the elephants, they said goodbye. Can you wave goodbye to the elephants? Bye! Good! And continued on their way. Next, they saw some zebras. Can you say, I see zebras? Very good. Again, the kids tiptoed over to the zebras. Go ahead and tiptoe. so that they wouldn't scare them. And the zebras heard them coming and began to run away. Can you pretend to be a zebra now? Go ahead, be a zebra. And go ahead, run away. How does a zebra run? Very good, run, 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 run. Go off stage right. All right, very good. Now transform yourself back into a kid. Go stand center stage. There you go. Soon the zebras were gone, and the kids kept going in their car. All of a sudden, a group of giraffes came galloping into the field. All right, now turn into, an, turn into a giraffe, and gallop, gallop, gallop. Can you gallop? Galloping is kind of like a horse, so go ahead and gallop. They stopped to eat. All right, can you pretend to eat like a giraffe? Remember, giraffes have long, long necks. You gotta eat. Eat the leaves from the tree. The baby giraffes couldn't reach their necks high enough to get to the leaves on the tree, so go ahead and keep trying. Ah, ah, ah. Finally, those baby giraffes were able to reach the leaves, and they ate and ate and ate. And the giraffes were very, very happy. Can you be a happy giraffe? Very good. When it was time for the giraffes to go, they galloped away. Gallop, 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 gallop. Very good. Go off stage. All right, come running back on center stage and be a kid again. The kids waved goodbye. And they kept going on their way. Soon it began to get dark and it was time for bed. So the kids rolled out their sleeping bags. Pretend to roll out your sleeping bag or your nap mat. And laid down. All right, now lay down on the ground. They looked up at the stars and then went to sleep. All right, now go to sleep. The next morning the kids got up to they packed their sleeping bags away, ate some breakfast, can you eat breakfast? Nom, 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 nom. And got back into the car. They drove to the airport and got on the airplane. All right, now keep flying. Very good. All the way back to their houses. That night, when the kids went to sleep, they remembered all the wonderful things they did and what they saw in Africa. The end. All right, guys. Hands all the way up in the air. Very good. Pay the bell. Great job, guys. That was so good. You guys did an awesome job. I miss you so much. I hope you're having a lot of fun at home. Keep pretending to be animals and keep remembering your address. And I will talk to you guys soon. Have a great day. Bye-bye.